Baron von Espy, what is your profession? <laughs> Silly man, I am a baron. Yes, but do you not also hold a day job, pain job, a, a square job? Well, one has to live. I am the concierge of Les Pantalons Rouge at Bad Gaddesburg in the canton of Uri. And what does that job entail? I satisfy such requests as the clientele may present. Towels, ice, etc. We are bellmen for that. No, no, no. Such requests that uh, were you at home, you would address not to your valet, but to your majordomo. Shush, <laughs> pooch, chow. I see. Baron, do you recognize that woman? <laughs> oh. Cher Marilyn, but of course, look who is here. <laughs> and she was a guest of the red trousers. Oh, many times for relaxing and making alpine recreation. <laughs> mm -hmm. I am curious about her visit of five years ago, January 1998. Can you remember any specific requests she made at that time? Yes, I can. And what, at that time, did she tell you she required? She said that she required a husband. <laughs> Do you want some bones, huh? Does Elvieta want some bones? Has anyone any bones? Does anyone have any bones? Bo uh, bones? Uh, can dog candies. No, they are not candies. Milk bones, hard, crunchy bones for the teeth. The, uh, uh, hard, uh, <clears throat> for the, uh, We'll attend to the dog later. Now, Baron, where were we? She said that she required a husband. Oh, do you want some bones? Does Elzbita want some bones? Has anyone any bones? Hard, crunchy bones for right. the... Right. Now, a husband. That's an unusual request. Did she specify what kind of a husband she was looking for? Stop. Objection. Grounds? Yeah. Hearsay. Not secondhand, Your Honor. This is direct testimony about the Baron's own conversation. I'm going to allow it. She said yeah. she wanted a very rich husband. She wanted to know the businesses and the wealths, the wealths, can I say this? Wealths of our various eligible guests. And did she have any other specifications? Objection, Your Honor. Inflammatory. What's good for the gander, Your Honor? Is this a legal argument, what's good for the gander? You got to play your tape, Freddy. Mr. Massey has a point there. I'm going to allow it. Were there any other specifications? She specificated a silly man. Objection, Your Honor. I'm going to allow she it. She specificated a man who, though clever at making money, would be easily duped and controlled. Objection, Your Honor. Shut up, Freddy. She's allowing it. She specificated a man with a wandering peepee. How you say? A philander whose affairs would be transparent to the world. Yeah, objection, Your Finally, Honor. Finally, a man whom she could herself brazenly cuckold. <laughs> Until such time as she might choose to, uh, we would say, fair and coup de marteau sur the face, you would say, make hammer on his fanny. Your Honor, objection! I irrelevant! I'm going to allow it! Tell us, Baron, did you introduce her to such a man? Sir, I am the concierge. And to whom did you introduce that calculating woman? I introduced her to that silly man. Your Honor, objection! Let the record show that the Baron has identified Rex Rexroth as the silly man. I did it. It was I. I introduced her to that silly man. You son of a bitch! Red first angry one. I introduced them. Damn silly. I did it. It was I. I just love trains. I love trains. You sick. No, no. I'm not sick. The other one is sick. No, no. Keep you please, sir. Not Objection, Your Honor. Strangling the witness. I'm going to allow it. <laughs>